Can you use a nebulizer with saline solution? Have you ever wondered if you can use a nebulizer with saline solution? This is a common question among patients and caregivers in the realm of respiratory care. Let's break down the facts to clarify this topic. Nebulizers are devices that turn liquid medication into a fine mist, allowing it to be inhaled directly into the lungs. They are widely used for various respiratory conditions, including asthma, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, and cystic fibrosis. Saline solution, particularly isotonic saline, which is a 0.9% sodium chloride solution, is often utilized in nebulizers. So, why is saline solution used in nebulizers? First, it helps to moisturize the airways. This is especially helpful for individuals with dry or irritated airways, making it easier for them to breathe. Secondly, saline can thin out mucus, which is beneficial for those who produce thick mucus due to conditions like cystic fibrosis. This thinning action makes it easier to expel mucus from the lungs. Additionally, nebulized saline can relieving nasal congestion. By loosening mucus and reducing inflammation in the nasal passages, it provides comfort to patients experiencing congestion. In a clinical setting, nurses frequently use saline solution in nebulizers as an adjunct therapy. It is considered safe, non-irritating, and can be administered regularly without significant side effects. When preparing saline for nebulization, it is essential to ensure that the solution is isotonic and preservative-free. This minimizes the risk of irritation or allergic reactions. When administering the saline solution, it should be placed in the nebulizer chamber, following the manufacturer's instructions. Monitoring the patient's response is vital, as nurses should observe for any signs of improvement or adverse reactions, such as increased coughing or shortness of breath. Reporting these observations to the healthcare team is also crucial. Sometimes, saline solution is mixed with other medications in a nebulizer. However, it is important to check that the medications are compatible before mixing. Certain medications, like Dornay's Alpha, should not be combined with other drugs due to potential changes in their properties. Always refer to the manufacturer's guidelines or local protocols before mixing any nebulizer solutions. In summary, using a nebulizer with saline solution is a common practice in respiratory care. It helps hydrate the airways, thins mucus, and can serve as an adjunct to other treatments. Nurses play a key role in ensuring the safe and effective administration of this therapy, making it an important aspect of respiratory care procedures.